how to use Tornado Cash to mix and preserve privacy for your wallets and funds in 20. 24. Hello guys, it's Johnny Time and welcome to another Web3 security tutorial. As you probably know, Tornado Cash got sanctions from uh, the USAC and he, the domains were removed, the hosting was removed and now people that want to preserve their privacy on the blockchain, uh, it's much harder than it used to be because it's hard to find the right Tornado Cash version, they don't know how to use it and you'll probably have a lot of question marks especially when there are so many clones and phishing attacks and phishing scam websites that are going around so in this tutorial I'm gonna show you exactly how to use securely safely not getting scammed not getting hacked in tornado cash in 2024 and preserve your privacy on the blockchain so without further ado let's get started Now before we start, I want to do a small disclaimer about privacy. So if you're a hacker, if you're a criminal, it's all on you. I do not recommend doing such things. This is bad, bad karma, bad energy, and you can get caught. Hopefully, if you're stealing from money from people, I hope that you will get caught and you will sit in jail. And this tutorial is for normal people who want to preserve their privacy because I believe that privacy is important and it doesn't make sense when you make a transaction of $5 that the receiver that received your money will know that you have $100,000 in this wallet. Why? Because it's none of his business, not your balance, not your previous transactions and this is how blockchain works, they are transparent. So once you someone knows the identity between a transaction to you, it can see all your previous transactions, all your balances, and this is something that doesn't happen in bank accounts, for example. And there are plenty of reasons why you want to preserve your privacy. You don't want anyone to know all your history of balances and transactions and how much money you have because it's personal information, right? And Maybe if you have also lots of money, you might put your life at risk. Someone might target you in a cybersecurity hack. Maybe someone will come in violent, with violence, blackmail you. So you always want to keep your privacy, right? I don't want to make you paranoid or scare you too much, but I think that privacy is important, especially in blockchain. That's why I make this tutorial, because I myself was trying to use Tornado Cash after the US sanctions, and it was pretty hard for me, and there were so many many clones, so many websites that I'm sure that some of them are scams and once you use them your wallet will be hacked, your funds will be stolen. So that's why I created this video to show you exactly how to do it securely, safely in 2024 to mix your funds and make sure your privacy is preserved without getting hacked by all those scammers. So currently, as you can see, if you search on Google Tornado Cash IPFS Tornado Cash 2024, how to use Tornado Cash, you see a lot of scam websites and scam videos. TornadoCash.eth.link, Tornado.ws, TornadoCash-IPFS.com, TornadoEth.cash. I didn't try this website, but I was too scared, to be honest. As someone that is aware about cybersecurity, about hacks, about scammers, I wouldn't like to deposit it to these smart contracts, to these websites. Maybe there is a malware, maybe the contract is malicious, it's not real Tornado Cash. And that's where I started exploring how I can still use Tornado Cash after the sanctions to keep my privacy, nothing criminal. I'm not saying that you're a criminal. I'm not criminal, I just value my privacy. But I couldn't find any solution, any tutorial. Be careful because all these people, there are bad people, bad scammers that are taking advantage of the situation, that it's not clear, that it's hard to find on out of cash, and they are launching all these phishing scam websites, all these fake if YouTube tutorials with voiceovers that look super scammy, you know. Use the link in the description of this video, Cloud for ETH, RPC Anchor, you know, all this malicious tornadocash.eth.link, probably a scam that's gonna steal your money, hack your wallet, whatever. The safest and most secure way to use Tornado Cash in 2024 is to go to the Twitter, official Twitter account, as you can see here, twitter.com or x.com Tornado Cash. Now, in this account, 
make sure it's official because also there are scam accounts and it has 64k followers make sure that you know that famous people are following this account because there are also scammers that are buying fake accounts with a lot of followers changing the name to tornado cash and trying to scam people the scammers are everywhere make sure take a look at the recent post make sure they are legit the engagement is legit everything is legit and and then you have two links here the first link is the telegram group this is a real telegram group of the tornado cash community so you can go there read messages ask questions and also this link which is the official ipfs deployed tornado cash instance and this is the only legit website that i found through the tornado cash account as you can see here it's on ipfs.io and this one i can guarantee that i used it and it worked and i didn't lose my money i didn't lose my wallet and this is the original website but now on ipfs so make sure only to go through the official tornado cash account through the twitter to the most recent version because this one might also be down in the next upcoming month who knows uh, I don't know what will happen to IPFS, probably not because it's IPFS, but still always keep track with this Telegram group and the Twitter account. So this one should work, you know, IPFS.io slash IPF IPNS and then TornadoCash.eth. Now, some tips to make sure that your privacy is preserved, because even if you use Tornado Cash, you can use it in a wrong way. And basically your wallet might get doxxed and people can reveal your identity. So... First thing, this uh, right widget over here is super important. What it means is when were the last deposits that people deposited through this Tornado Cash smart contract. Why it is important? Because the way Tornado Cash works is that it's going to mix your fund with other people deposits. So if you're now going to go here to deposit, deposit, let's say one ETH, uh, you are basically depositing the ETH to the smart contract and you receive a proof that you deposited this ETH, some kind of text file or a, a long string. And then later on, you can do it right away, go to the withdrawal, paste the note over here, paste the recipient address and withdraw the money. Now, if you do it right away, it's not safe. You are losing your privacy because it's pretty obvious that you just deposited and withdraw ETH. That's why you need to wait several hours, maybe several days, depends on the deposit activity. And obviously now the Tornado Cash is less popular, it's sanctioned, there are less people that are using it. We have less deposits and the less deposits that we have, the less privacy we have. Because when there are more deposits, your transactions and your deposits are being mixed with other transactions. So you always want to make sure that the blockchain that you are using Tornado Cash, there are a lot of deposits that, and you need to wait a certain amount of time. Here I would wait at least one day, you know. Because you see, one hour ago, five hours ago, five hours, six hours, six hours, six hours. There are plenty of transactions, but if we go to another blockchain, like, I don't know, Optimism, for instance, you want to mix Ether in Optimism, you see that obviously there are less deposits, like 24 days ago, 25 days ago, a month ago. I would never recommend you to use Tornado Cash on Optimism. Unfortunately, you will have to bridge the funds to another blockchain maybe Ethereum because it's more active, there are more deposits, and then do that because if you're going to do it in Optimism, you're going to lose your privacy since you're the only one that is using Tornado Cash smart contracts in Optimism. Same, I think, also with Polygon. There are not many transactions and Binance Smart Chain. So make sure that there are enough deposits and not only you. You know, here, Polygon, five days ago, if you go to Binance Smart Chain, probably going to be two days or one day. Yeah, three hours. Oh, pretty active. So the most active, the most amount of deposits are BSC and Ethereum. Make sure you do your mixing there. Again, I'm not advocating any criminals or any hacks or something like that. I just believe that privacy is important. I hope this video will not get removed because I'm not doing anything illegal. Basically, I'm just helping people to not get scammed because, you know, Tornado Cash still exists and people still use it. But unfortunately, because of everything that happened with the sanctions, with the website and hosting and the DNS going down and RPC are blocking it also. Ah, that's another important point. If your RPC is blocking it, you might try to deposit funds and it will not work. You will not understand why. That's because... Uh, your RPC providers the, the, that is sending your transaction from your MetaMask wallet is blocking the transactions to these smart contracts. 
what you want to do is change your RPC provider. Go to chainlist.org and just go, if it's on Ethereum, then just open here the Ethereum list. And you want to make sure that you use an RPC provider with privacy in green. So it's it's checked, you know. This one with X means that if you use these RPC providers, um, uh, first of all, they might share your data with other companies. And second, uh, you might get blocked when you try to preserve your privacy through Tornado Cash. So change your Ethereum RPC provider to Llama RPC, to Public Node, to Smoke IO, whatever, just if it doesn't work for you. Um, and that's how you should uh, overcome this obstacle. These are the tips to summarize. First, make sure you use the original website through the Tornado Cash official Twitter account. Second, make sure there are enough deposits. Preferably use BSC or Ethereum for mixing ETH or BNB. And third, if your RPC is blocking the transaction, use chainlist.org to find an alternative uh, RPC provider that supports privacy, that doesn't block you when you try to interact with Tornado Cash smart contracts. And these are the most important tips. This is how to use Tornado Cash in 2024. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button and subscribe to the channel for more awesome Web3 and Web3 security content. Thank you so much and I will see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.